I give a lot of credit to Celine. They could have easily you know, folded, but that's a well-coached team. Those are good kids over there. Um, and so I give them a lot of credit. And then our, our guys, we just came up with a couple clutch hits there in the end and double play to end it. I mean, you can't write a you can't write a better ending than that for us. Talking about just this trip here at Michigan State, I mean, you pitched them a victory, the semifinals close it out here. What does that mean to you? It's a great feeling. I never thought I would be here right now with my team, and I wouldn't be here without them. I mean, did you ever imagine that you'd be on the mound with bases loaded? And <laughs> no, I did not expect that. It was the last thing I was expecting. Just had a little trouble with your command. Uh, you uh, I had that much time to warm up. Oh, okay. Can you, can you talk about that last pitch you gave him that he grounded into the point with? It was a two seam. Just try to throw a strike because I was struggling a little bit, and if he hit it. Don't it was a don't play. Uh, the runners getting scoring position for you. Um, <laughs> did you feel any more pressure at that point to knock those runs in? Or um, well, I knew I had a job to do, so I had to protect the plate. The two strikes on me. Gave me an outside curve, took it up the middle, got the runs in. And, uh, you know, a lot of youth on this team. I guess, how would you define this group and what made them successful this year? Uh, we have probably one of the best sophomore classes around, so we have a bright future. So I'm pretty sure we'll be here again. So.